Well, gerrymandering has existed forever, but it's gotten so much worse in recent years, with the maps being so sophisticated in terms of how they're drawn, and Republicans, in particular, targeting Democrats in such sophisticated ways. So you have a situation in Wisconsin, for example, which is where my new piece in Rolling Stone is set, where in 2012, Democrats won 51 percent of the vote in Wisconsin, but Republicans picked up 60 of 99 seats in the Wisconsin State Assembly. So you have a situation in America, not just in Wisconsin, but in other states as well, where Republicans are getting a minority of votes, but a majority of seats. And that violates basic norms of American democracy. It violates the whole notion of one person, one vote. We like to think in this country, if you get the most votes, you're the winner. Well, that's not how it works because of gerrymandering right now.